In 2012, a new insect pest was first detected in the UK. Drosophila suzukii, or spotted wing drosophila, SWD, is a small fruit fly that presents a serious threat to the soft fruit industry. Research at the James Hutton Institute forms part of a cross-industry, UK-wide initiative funded by the AHDB and Scottish Government. We aim to understand the pest biology and help growers manage and control this damaging pest. Unlike its more common relative, Drosophila melanogaster, SWD is attracted to underripe fruit using its saw-like ovipositor to lay eggs on the ripening fruit. Early detection is crucial to minimising the impact of SWD and therefore monitoring the pest is a priority. It also alerts growers to any increase in abundance and identifies hotspots for the pest. Several commercial traps and baits are available. Holes are dr drilled in the two sides of the trap which allow the adult flies to enter. It's important to monitor wild sites on the farm such as woodland and hedgerows in addition to the fruit crop. The trap catch is examined using a hand lens or microscope. Males are identified by a large spot along the front edge of each wing. There are also two dark sex combs on the forelegs. The female is recognised by its serrated ovipositor, but usually a microscope is required to see this structure. The data can be used to identify any potential increase in pest numbers in hotspot areas. It's also important to monitor the crop and wild fruit for the presence of spotted wing drosophila using flotation and emergence testing. Details of how to carry out these simple tests can be found on the AHDB website. The best approach to manage the impact of SWD is an integrated management policy. This includes early crop monitoring, scrupulous hygiene and crop housekeeping, thorough disposal of da damaged and waste fruit, and picking right through to the end of the season using recommended control products only when necessary. One aim of the project is to identify and study natural enemies of spotted wing drosophila for potential biocontrol. These include predatory insects, pathogens and parasitoids. Work at the James Hutton Institute involves monitoring for native parasitic wasp species that attract drosophila. Box traps are loaded with bait the bait is created using strawberry fruits colonised by larvae or pupae of Drosophila. The trap is sealed with a mesh lid with holes large enough to allow Drosophila parasitoids to enter but small enough to stop the Drosophila leaving and to prevent other insects from entering. The trap is then placed inside a red delta trap for support and protection and it's left in situ for two weeks to allow native parasitoids to enter and lay eggs in the developing Drosophila. The trap is then brought back to the Hutton and checked weekly for six weeks for any emerging parasitoids, which are subsequently identified using a microscope and DNA barcoding techniques. More information and advice on spotted ring drosophila are available on the AHDB website.